In this video, we will name the properties used in the following equations and letters where used represent real numbers. First equation is 4 plus 9 is equal to 9 plus 4. According to commutative law for addition, for all a, b belongs to set of real numbers a plus b is equal to b plus a. So by this law, we can say that the property used in this equation is commutative property with respect to addition. Second equation is a plus 1 plus 3 by 4 is equal to a plus 1 plus 3 by 4. According to associative law of addition, for all a, b, c belong to set of real numbers a plus b plus c is equal to a plus b plus c. So, from this law, we can say that the property used in this equation is associative property with respect to addition. Third equation is square root 3 plus square root 5 plus square root 7 is equal to square root 3 plus square root 5 plus square root 7. According to associative law of addition, for all a, b, c belongs to set of real numbers a plus b plus c is equal to a plus b plus c. By using this law, it can be said that the property used in this equation is associative property with respect to addition. Fourth equation is 100 plus 0 is equal to 100. By law of additive identity, we know that for all A belong to set of real numbers, there exist 0 belong to set of real numbers, such that A plus 0 is equal to 0 plus A equal to A. So, from the definition of additive identity, we can say that the property used in this equation is property of additive identity. Fifth equation is 1000 multiplied by 1 is equal to 1000. By definition of law of multiplicative identity, we know that for all A belong to set of real numbers, there exist 1 belong to set of real numbers, such that A dot 1 is equal to 1 dot A equal to A, where A dot 1 is the product of A and 1 and 1 dot A is the product of 1 and A. So, from the law of multiplicative identity, it can be said that the property used in this equation is property of multiplicative identity. Equation number 6 is 4.1 plus minus 4.1 is equal to 0. From property of additive inverse, we know that for all a belong to set of real numbers, there exist minus a belong to set of real numbers, such that a plus minus a is equal to 0, which is equal to minus a plus a. From this definition, it can be said that the property used in this equation is property of additive inverse. Equation number 7 is a minus a is equal to 0. By law of additive inverse, we know that for all a belong to set of real numbers, there exist minus a belong to set of real numbers, such that a plus minus a is equal to 0, which is equal to minus a plus a. From this definition of additive inverse, we can say that the property used in this equation is property of additive inverse. Equation number 8 is square root 2 multiplied by square root 5 is equal to square root 5 multiplied by square root 2. 
by commutative law of multiplication we know that for all a b belong to set of real numbers a b product is equal to b a product so by this definition it can be said that the property used in this equation is commutative property with respect to multiplication equation number 9 is a multiplied by b minus c is equal to ab product minus ac product by definition of left distributive property for all a b c belong to set of real numbers a multiplied by b minus c is equal to ab minus ac so the property used in this equation is left distributive property equation number 10 is x minus y multiplied by z is equal to xz product minus yz product by definition of right distributive property for all a b c belong to set of real numbers a minus b multiplied by c is equal to ac product minus bc product so by this definition it can be said that the property used in this equation is right distributive property equation number 11 is 4 multiplied by 5 multiplied by 8 is equal to 4 multiplied by 5 multiplied by 8 from associative law for multiplication we know that for all a b c belong to set of real numbers a multiplied by b c product is equal to a b product multiplied by c so by using this law we can say that the property used in this equation is associative property with respect to multiplication equation number 12 is a multiplied by b plus c minus d is equal to ab product plus ac product minus ad product by left distributive law we can say that for all a b c d belong to set of real numbers a multiplied by b plus c minus d is equal to ab product plus ac product minus ad product by this definition it can be said that the property used in this equation is left distributive property